Hey, what's up, everyone? Um, recent pickup video, a new one. I got this in a couple days ago. It is a Supreme pickup. This is a week. I think I want to say week six. It's the same week that they dropped with the Clippers, which now I'll talk about it right now. It's a huge fucking fail. Um, only got one thing. I got the hoodie. Where's my stickers? Yo, what the fuck? Oh. There they are. Um, yeah. So about the release, this is the week they dropped with those, um, Andy's Clippers, like the, the cordless ones. And fucking bullshit. I just, just lagging servers, dude. Um, when they did it, I probably got the Clippers out of the car, checked out around 8, too much, like, a couple, like, like 10 seconds after 8 o'clock. And then it was, it was on a processing screen for about, no lie, about two minutes. And usually when it takes longer to process, that means, okay, you know what I mean? You got it. When it takes like a couple of seconds, you already notice that it's going to say all oh, car declined or whatever. So I was waiting on that. And then it went back to my car and I tried to check out again. And then it's still processing. And then the shit said sold out or something like that. So that bullshit. It was just the servers are fucking up. And then I got the split. Uh, old English hoodie. I was my plan was if I didn't get that, I was gonna get this, but in the gray and white, and then a coach jacket in the black. This one I was gonna get to sell. The jacket, the coach one I was gonna get for me personally, but this shit sold out too bad. And I was gonna get the pink one. I had it in my car and I checked out. And this shit sold out by the time I got it, I checking out. So I went back and I scooped up this one, the coach jacket. The fuck, I wanted that one, but I fucked up on it. So more or less, the Clippers ruined everything. So it's a waste of my time. But, you know, I got this. So. That's what it is. This is Split Old English Hoodie. Sorry. Um, This. So I got it ready to sell it. But I think I'm going to keep this. Because this shit is pretty fine. So yeah, I'm going to take it out. I'm going to show you guys. Because it's this. Hopefully, I got the right sizing. Kind of the sizing. Last this is the last one, that hoodie I got with a Playboy hoodie. I got a large that shit fit, but it was like way too snug. So this one I got an XL, but I looked at the sizing after I bought it on their site, and I think I should have got a large because I don't know why, but so hopefully it don't feel like way too fucking huge. If not, then I'm about to sell it. But they really see in like six different colorways. The best one, in my opinion, were this one, the Sherbert, and like the white. And the green and pink's alright, but I mean, that was like the most hyped up one, so. But I think, in my opinion, this one's the best one. The all black. They have the black embroidery right here. All stitched in, old English font. And then this brown, like, brown patch, kind of tannish patch. This shit looks pretty clean. The retail was like 150, 160. And by the time I checked out shipping, taxes, all that bullshit, it was like 180, 190. I don't know, it's a pretty dope piece. I need a better view of it. It's just pretty clean. They released another jacket with it. Uh, another, I think another one. Um, with uh, this week, I forgot what it was. But yeah, the most quickly video I'll show you guys. I should be getting another stream unboxing next week, so stay tuned for that. So this, I'm um, probably going to keep it, but if it fits way too big, then I'll probably sell it. And I'll, uh, no, that's you guys know. Put a link to my girl account. Oh, also, I still have those three tees for sale. My girl account, the Piss Christ, Madonna and Child, and the France tee. So if you're interested or you know someone looking for those, watch my old video. I have the link in the description to my account, and then we maybe work something out. All right, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Peace.